Jude is a worker in a classic office space where rows of cubicles separate individuals. Jude had been working the same position and doing the same job for the better part of seven years. But things were about to get crazy. The walls of the cubicles had been lifted and replaced with things to help with teamwork and camaraderie. This has greatly improved the company's workflow, but at the cost of Jude's performance. Misplacing this, dropping that, forgetting those, all minor mistakes on their own, but it only built up tension for what would happen next. Yeah, um, I, I think I put the old ink in that printer. I mean, were you there when Castro presented this? I'm very clearly stated to not put the old ink in the new fucking printer. Yeah, yeah, I remember him saying that. As soon as you were done with your lunch, Mr. Claiborne would like to see you in his office. So, what you're saying is, I have a meeting with Bob tomorrow at 4.30. I'll talk in my schedule, but yeah, I, I should be able to make that work. All right, thanks. Uh, Mr. Claiborne? Jude, <laughs> come on in, please. Take a seat. Uh, uh, Mr. Claiborne? Um, I, I noticed that, uh, I hadn't received my annual raise just yet, um, and I was wondering when that might be coming into effect. Give me one second. Hey, what's up, Court? Are you still in the field? Yeah, that's good, that's good. You did what to the printer? I mean, was he was there when Casper explained all that, correct? All right. Oh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, we're going to have a good talk about that. All right. It'll be taken care of. All right. Bye. The reason I brought you in here is because your performance is lacking. What's going on? Is it the changes we've made in December? Hey, I understand. We made a lot of abrupt changes to the workflow and I'm sure you're used to working on your own and you're really good at that and you've been a reliable worker, heck, more than reliable. And I love the energy you brought to the team and these last few weeks just haven't been your best. And, you know, I figured a lot of you guys need a little time to adjust and do changes, but this is week four. It's just... I 
I want the best for you. I mean, not for the company's sake, but for your sake. And as for your raise coming up, it's coming up in March, and it's based on your performance. Oh, but at the end of the day, still running a business. Products still need producing. Services still need service. And if I got to find someone else to take that role, that's what I got to do. I don't want to do it. I like you. Good guy. You've been with me seven years. But, I mean... Yeah. Yo. So what you're saying is I have another meeting today at 3.30. It's a little late to tell me that because it's 3.30 right now.